Hello everyone and welcome back to this thing. This here. is uh, a tale of Under? underwear. Under? Is it Underwear Tale? Is that what this is? Sure, let's go with that. Awesome. Welcome back to Underwear Tale, everybody. Um, let's continue. Alright, I can't Where wait to we? do this. Alright, we're, we're in Lava Place. Hot you, land. you guys don't want me to go in. I'm filled with determination. That guy's gonna take me to hell. Alright, let's go. Did you ever talk to those two? Yeah, I did. Okay. They were just kind of grumpy. Right? Yeah, he's just grumpy. Yeah. So Undine, like, told us that there was totally a human in the area. So, like, uh, swirled guards are blocking off the elevators for now. Ah, so they're surfer guards. Got it. Ah, even if the elevators aren't working in anyway, we'll do our best, Miss Undine. Really? The elevators aren't even working? Seeing this train laboratory place like this. Determination. Cool. I'm gonna save it anyway, just... It was a very important save. I'm filled with determination, so... Is that like a spotlight or a camera? I think it's dark in here. Oh, cool. Nope, it's a camera. Called it. <laughs> not gonna look at it? It's too dark to see near the walls. Oop. Not gonna check out the camera? They're all gonna say the same thing. What it's too this? dark. That's an escalator going down. Run faster, child. It's you? It's too dark to see near the walls! <laughs> Uh-oh. Things are happening. Ah, excellent. It's the, uh, doctor. Hello! Hey, he looks like an older version of that kid that we kept beating on earlier. Oh. I mean... My god. I didn't expect you to show up so soon. I haven't showered. I'm barely dressed. It's all messy and... And... Um... <laughs> Hiya! I'm Dr. Alphys. I'm Asgore's royal scientist. Cool. B -b but, uh... I'm not one of the bad guys. Actually, since you stepped out of the ruins, I've, um, been observing your journey through my console. Uh-huh. And how much of my journey have you observed? Since you left the <laughs> ruins. Did, like, the whole thing? Even that, that whole date I went on? Because <laughs> I'd like to have... That erase tapes. from history. <laughs> if that's okay. Your fights, your friendships, everything. I was originally going to stop you, but... Watching someone on a screen really makes you root for them. So, uh, now I want to help you. Using my knowledge, I can easily guide you through Hotland. Alright, cool. I know a way right to Asgore's castle, no problem. Awesome. Where he'll probably kill me. Well, actually, um, there's just a tiny issue. A long time ago, I made a robot named Metaton. Not Metatron? No, it's Metaton. <laughs> Originally, I built him to be an entertainment robot. Uh, like the story you know, like a robotic TV star or something. Anyway, recently I decided to make him more useful. Uh -huh. You know, just some small practical adjustments. Like, um, the anti, anti-human combat features. Of course, when I saw you coming, I immediately decided I have to remove those features. Unfortunately, I may have made a TNC mistake while doing so. And, um... You made it worse, didn't you? Now he's an unstoppable killing machine with thirst for a human blood. Yeah, I call that worse. You're an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> but um, hopefully we won't run into him. Just, I would not be surprised if he burst through the wall right now. Really? <laughs> Did you hear something? Oh no. Oh yes. Welcome, beauties. Oh my god. To today's quiz wall. show. <laughs> he actually burst through the wall. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, I can already tell it's gonna be a great show. Everyone give a big hand for our wonderful contestant. 
Never played before, gorgeous? No problem, it's simple. There's only one rule. Answer correctly. Or die. Or you die. Yeah. Mediton attacks. <laughs> He's just cowering. Alright. Act. You can check or cry. Both. <laughs> First we get a check up. Metaton, 10 attack, 999 defense. His metal body renders him invulnerable to attack. Oh, cool. Let's start with an easy one. I'm okay with easy one. What's the prize for answering correctly? Uh, more questions. Right! Sounds like you get it. The quiz show continues. Oh, sweet. Screaming is against the rules. Here's your terrific prize! What's the king's full name? Uh... Lord Fluffy Go. Fuzzy Pushover, Asgore Dreamer, Dr. Friendship. Correct! What a terrific answer! The quiz show continues. Answer the quiz. <sighs> you can keep crying or you can try spare. Enough about you, let's talk about me. What are robots made of? Hopes and dreams, metal and magic, ships and snails, sugar and spice. Uh, Too easy for you, huh? The quiz show continues. Here's another easy one for you. Two trains, train A and train B, simultaneously depart station A and station B. Station A and station B are 252.5 miles apart from each other. Train A is moving at 124.7 miles per hour towards station B, and train B is moving at- WRONG WRONG WRONG! <laughs> that sucked. Alright then. Don't count on your victory! How many flies are in this jar? Correct! Yes! You're so lucky today! <laughs> the quiz show continues. <laughs> that was programmed to always be right, isn't it? No, it isn't. You really? just locked it. Yeah! <laughs> Let's play memory game! That's not. What monster is this? Fine, though, that's a toad, right? A frog it? Cool frog it. Boy, that's embarrassing, huh? The quiz show continues. Wait, that was him with a frog it shirt. Yep. You suck, sir. I was right. <laughs> But can you get this one? Oh crap, I'm gonna die. Would you smooch a ghost? Yes! It's going out, by the way, the timer. <laughs> um... Huh. Anyway, okay. what's your answer? Heck yeah! Great answer! I love it! The quiz show continues. I should probably get help. Wait... Okay. Well, he is the program to destroy me, so... Let's... Let's get some CT. Nah, uh, crab apple. Snow bee. You eat the crab apple. Your HP was maxed out. Here's a simple one. I'm okay with it. How many letters in the name Mediton? Uh. <laughs> No, no, no! Can't you read? <laughs> the quiz show continues. Sounds weird. Okay. Um... Time to break out the big guns! In the dating simulation video game Mew Mew Kissy Cutie. Oh, oh, I know this one! It's snail ice cream! In the fourth chapter, everyone goes to the beach and she buys ice cream for all of her friends, but it's snail flavor and she's the only one who wants it. It's one of my favorite parts of the game because it's actually a very powerful message about friendship and. Alphus, Alphus, Alphus. You aren't helping our contestant, are you? Uh, no. Oh, you should have told me. I'll ask a question. You'll be sure to know the answer to. Who does Dr. Alphus have a crush on? There is no timer. 
No, there is not. Uh, the human. I'm thinking. Let's go with the human. Seriously? Oh, yeah. My, my. How conceited can you get? Pretty conceited. I love it! And while you are completely wrong, you deserve some credit. I've seen her watch you on her computer screen. Wait, that's a sheep? Yes, obviously it's a sheep. Well, shit. <laughs> it is hard to tell with dinosaurs. Smiling when you succeed, shrieking when you fail, and always, always whispering. No, wrong, you have to go that way. In its own way, is this not love? Well, well, well. With Dr. Alpha's helping you, the show has no dramatic tension. We can't go on like this. But, but, this was just the pilot episode. Next up, more drama, more romance, more bloodshed. Until next time, darlings. Well, that just happened. Well, that was certainly something. There you go. Now you can look around. Wait, wait! Let me give you my phone number. Th then, maybe, if you need help, I could... Well, where'd you get that phone? It's ancient! It doesn't even have texting. Well, wait a second, please. Somebody was screaming. I think that was a power trip. Here, I upgraded it for you. It can do texting, items, it's got a keychain. I even signed you up for the Underground's number one social network. Now we're officially friends. <laughs> oh, this guy. I'm going to the bathroom. It's a video feed of your location. A garbage can, but it's pretty cute. Seems like the notes to something, but it's all written in chicken scratch. It seems like a walkthrough to a game, or... It's a computer. It's accessing some kind of puzzle in Snowden. <laughs> it's a beat-up figurine of a female human with cat ears. Check out the little dinosaur cup. It's a teacup shaped like a yellow lizard. It's full of soda. The fridge is filled with instant noodles and soda. Perfect. Take a package of noodles. Yes. Go ahead. Yeah, we're friends. You got the instant noodles. Hooray. It's a bag of dog food. It's half full. You is a dog? You're gonna check out the... Uh... The is it noodles? Oh, uh, yeah, I can do that. It's, uh, I don't know. Instant noodles. Instant noodles. Heals HP. Comes with everything you need for a quick meal. Cool. Yeah, you can't go up the down escalator. I had to try. Also, check out your phone. Check it. Now you have dimensional box A and B. Now you can access your storage box from anywhere at any time. Cool. And you also have a second one. That's pretty neat. Is that the... that's the little lizard's room. Cool. It's up here. The space behind the wall is only a few feet wide. He was hiding in there. <laughs> waiting for me to show up. That's just weird. <clears throat> it's a bathroom sign. Yellow feet are tapping just behind the door. Alright then. I'm gonna go up the escalator? Yeah. They're like progressive to the room. Scientific books. They seem very dusty. All these books are labeled human history. You look inside a book. It's a comic of a giant robot fighting a beautiful alien princess. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. Although it does explain Undine's obsession. Yeah. VHSs and DVDs of various cartoons. They are all labeled human history. <laughs> all these books are labeled human history. You look inside a book. It's a comic book. 
two scantily clad chefs are flinging energy pancakes at each other. That sounds awesome. It does. I want to read that. <laughs> this doesn't strike you as very accurate. But it does strike me as very awesome. <laughs> All these books are labeled human history. You look inside a book. It's a comic book. A hideous android is running to school with toast in its mouth. Seems like it's late. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. I, I don't know. <laughs> hideous androids. Pink goop drips from this strange machine. Whoop. <laughs> Looks like Alphys' work table seems dusty. The wardrobe is full of dirty lab coats and a single clean dress. There are letters from many monsters here. Froggit, Snowy, Doggo. They're all unopened. It's a lamp with pink fish on the lampshade. There's no light bulb. <laughs> an incredible invention. When not in use, this bed folds into an extremely easy to draw box. It's a promo poster for Metaton's TV premiere. On the flap it says, thank you for making my dreams come true. Hmm. There we go. We've looked around the laboratory. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's not here. She. She, sorry. On to the future. Alphys updated status. Just realized I didn't watch Undine fight the human. Oh, really? Well, you have it recorded. Alphys updated status. Well, I know she's unbeatable. I'll ask her about it later. Yeah, I ran like a little bit. Alphys updated status. For now, I gotta call up the human and guide them. That... those shouldn't be status updates, man. Well, you don't use Facebook that much. That's true. I don't use Facebook at all. And I did Vulcan strolls in. Vulcan. Volcano? Vulcan? Yep. He looks like he's asleep. I should've went back and healed him. <clears throat> well... Check, criticize, encourage, or hug. Vulcan 8 attack, negative 10 defense. Mistakenly believes its lava can heal people. Oh. Oh. <laughs> You're hurt! I'll help! I am hurt, actually. Ah, whoa, hello. Yeah, the hotline yeah. enemies are more difficult than anything you've faced before. Well, I should hope so. Vulcan is wiggling its weird rump. I'll encourage it. You tell Vulcan it's doing a great job. Its attacks become extreme. Oh, that's not... Ah! Ah! That's my best! Uh oh I don't like extreme attacks. Extreme attacks are a bad thing. Vulcan parades around you proudly. Okay. Oh, excellent. <laughs> Let's get out of here! <laughs> you won. You earned 0 XP and 40 gold. You might want to heal. Well, yes. Like, right now. Or chance more enemy encounters, I guess. Yeah, I'll heal the uh, cheap way. I wonder if you can take more nodes. I don't think so. Notice that it didn't tell you how, how much HP it heals. Yeah. No, you only get one. Although, why would you keep instant noodles in the fridge? Maybe it's a hot fridge. <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, then the soda would explode. True. I've actually tried that. It's amusing, but also incredibly dangerous. dangerous. <laughs> I killed the determination. Awesome. Let's get out of here. I've seen what happens when freezers are too freezery. Blowing up can. Oh, yeah. Uh, we used to have a cooler that you could plug in that actually like acted as a small refrigerator, but it had a setting where you could flip it to warming rather than cooling. Just like, it was pretty cool. Uh, we blew up. That, that's how I learned about blowing up pop. Alpha's updated status. Gonna call them in a minute. And, uh... The left one's too. Yeah. Sunday a plane gets in the way. Not on purpose or anything. Uh, I've actually heard about this one. Sunday Plane is like my favorite enemy in this game. <laughs> is that a beret? 
It's like a weird hood with a ribbon or something. Huh. I see. I'd, I'd quit, don't really know. But it is a new thing. You can check, flirt, or approach. Thunderplane. Eight attack, six defense. Seems mean, but does it secretly like you? <laughs> no way! Why would I like you? Are they dropping bombs? Something like that. It is an airplane. That makes sense. Thunderplane looks That's over, funny. then turns up its nose. Alright then. Yeah, that'll probably end up terrible. Uh, fuck it. You tell Sunderplane that it has cute winglets. Huh? Y you sicko? Yeah, I didn't think that would work out for me. What? 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 <laughs> Sunderplane gives you a condescending barrel roll. Give it a shot. May as well. You get close to Sunderplane, but not too close. Eh, human. Get close, but not too close. Oh. oh, hey, that's pretty cool. You need to give more of them. Yeah, I, I know. It smells like an airport can perfume county. Eh, human. Thunderplane accidentally bumps you with its wing. <laughs> cool. Alright, let's get out of here. Is there anything else I should do? I don't know, but they're hard. <laughs> you won. You win 0 XP and 60 gold. That'd you get a lot of thing. gold in this area. Ooh, 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 ooh. That was cool. Up the pipes. Nothing like pipe bridges. Oh, pipe bridges. Hey! The whooshing sound of steam and conks. It fills you with determination. Of course it does. The Magma Chamber. Alpha's updated status. I hate using the phone. I don't want to do this LMAO. Do people actually act like this? I mean... Well, I think it's an exaggeration, but yes. Whee! That, this is fun. I like this area. Go right. right. Alpha's updated status. OMG, I've had my claw over the last digit for five minutes. OMG, I'm just gonna do it. I'm just gonna call. Pyro bounds towards you. Hello, Pyro. 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 Oh, I get it, because he's a rope. On fire. Check, cooldown, heat up, or invite. Pyro, 8 attack, 1 defense. This mischievous monster is never warm enough. Hmm. So it's you. Hot enough for you? So you gotta go through the fire. <laughs> Pyro, that, I, that was actually better than I've ever done in my life. <laughs> Pyrope is pretending to pull the fire on her. Pretending. Um, let's invite. Let's see what happens. You invite Pyrope to hang out. Sorry, I'm all tied up. I walk right into that one. Pyrope is chuckling through its teeth. Alright then, Pyrope, let's heat this. You crank up the thermostat. Pyro <laughs> begins to get excited. I like how everything's all wobbly now. Hot! Hot! Hotter! Hotter! Mm, dang it. Pyro wants more heat. Of course he does. Alright, Pyro, let's do this. You crank up the thermostat. It's super hot. Pyro looks satisfied. Hot! Hot! Hotter! Hotter! The room is sweltering. Perfect. Okay. What happens if you invite him to hang out in the super hot? Mm. Eh, whatever. I don't want to hear <laughs> that joke again. You won. You win 0 XP and 45 gold. I feel like I should just keep making it hotter. I don't think it goes hotter than that. Ooh, a frying pan. Hey, you got it right the first time. Yeah. There's a fry pan lying on the ground. Will you take it? Yes. You got the burnt pan. Burnt pan. Burnt pan. Weapon attack, 10. Damage is rather consistent. Consumable items heal 4 more HP. Ooh. That doesn't really help too much. Most of my consumable items 
bring you up to full anyway. <laughs> yeah, well, it helps. That's more than none. Yeah, that. <clears throat> I'm at attack two. Torn notebook and clouded glasses. I feel like those help me. Yeah. They increase your invincibility frames, but that hasn't really been helping much. You're right. Let's uh, You equipped the burnt pack. And now you can just store your old item. Because you have your box with you at all times. Oh, right. Using your cell phone. So, virtual box. Cool. There's nothing on the right side. Nothing. That's just the fail. If you fail in getting it the right timing Fair down enough. correctly. Yep. Yeah. And left. Ring, ring. Click. Whoever was calling hung up before you answered it. Really? You're that nervous? Was I actually correct in that? Thing. Uh, hi, so the blue lasers. Uh, I mean, Elf is here. Hi! The blue lasers won't hurt you if you don't move. That makes sense. Orange ones, um, y you have to be moving and they, um, they won't, um, move through those ones. Uh, bye. Click. Thank you. Elf has updated status. OMG, I did it. Claws haven't shook like that since Undine called me to ask about the weather. You have... Okay. Alpha's updated status. Wait, there's no weather down here. Why did she call me? <sighs> nice. <laughs> it's a switch. The lasers were deactivated. That was flawless. So now you know what to do when orange things are on the screen. Mm -hmm. Alpha's updated status. Oh my god, I forgot to tell them where to go. Yeah, don't worry about it. Alpha's posted a picture. Cute pic of me right now. It's a photo of a garbage can with several pink glittery filters over it. That's... Remember, her cute. garbage can is pretty cute. That's true. Bing. Uh, Alpha's here. What's up? The, the northern door will stay locked until you... Solve the puzzles on the right and left. I I think you should, should g g go to the right first. Quick. I feel like I should go to the left first. Yeah, I go to the right first. Screw it. Listen to Undine. There you go. Got them here wrong. <laughs> Listen, Listen to Undine too. She'll probably kill me. Yeah. Alpha's updated status. Wonder if it would be unfun if I explained the puzzle. It would be unfun. Please don't explain the puzzle. The way the work is blocked. So I had time to catch Metaton's show on my phone. The special effects were amazing today. That humans almost looked real. Metaton? Yeah, he's the most popular star in the underground. His fan club probably has at least two, no, three dozen members. Nice. Pretty sure that's more than we got. Subscribers. Yeah, it is. The door leading through the area is closed, so I tried the puzzle? But I kept running out of ammo and it kept restarting? And my two co-workers won't help? It's like they don't even want to go to work! Shoot the opposing ship. Move the boxes to complete your mission. You have two shots. Oh, I can move the boxes like that. Cool. There you go. Congratulations. That was pretty neat. So you got the right one, and you have to get the left one. Ring. Alphys! Here! Th that blue laser seems totally impassable. B -b -b but, as the royal scientist, I have some tricks up my sleeve. I'll hack into the, the Hotland laser database and take it out. We were hanging out when suddenly a bunch of puzzles reactivated out of nowhere. This is a huge problem. It rules! They've gotta cancel school over this. Finally, someone turned off that laser. Now that we're free, we can... Well, uh, I guess we'll just keep standing here. Alright. You guys do that. Ooh. 
Shoot the opposing ship. Move the boxes to complete your mission. It gets difficult. Hmm. That's why it's just hitting the right. Oh, the left is much more difficult. Just neat. Puzzle line. Oh, oh you almost had it, actually. Down. Cool. Congratulations. There you go. That was fun. Both puzzles are done. I kind of like those puzzles. Everyone likes those puzzles. So. I am doing a human reward. Alpha's updated stats. Whatever. I'll just explain it. No, don't, don't even bother. Uh, I think, um... Hey, about the puzzles on the left and right? They're a bit difficult to explain, but... Uh, you already solved them? Awesome! Click. Never should have given a camera. This is my mind. Uh oh. Can't see shit, Captain. Ring. Uh, hey, it's kind of dark in there, isn't it? Don't worry. I'll hack into the light system and brighten it up. Uh. Oh no. Dang it. <laughs> oh, yes. Welcome, beauties, to the Underground's premier cooking show. Cooking with a killer robot. I like it, actually. I kind of want to see that show. Preheat your ovens, because we've got a very special recipe for you today. We're going to be making... a cake! My lovely assistant here will gather the ingredients. Everyone give them a big hand. We'll need sugar, milk, and eggs. Go for it, sweetheart. You found the sugar. You found the milk. You found the eggs. Perfect! Great job, beautiful! We've got all of the ingredients we need to bake the cake. Milk, sugar, eggs... Oh my! Wait a magnificent moment! How could I forget? We're missing the most important ingredient. <laughs> a human soul. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Slow down, Captain. Ring. Hello? I'm kind of in the middle of something here. Well, wait a second. Couldn't you make a... Couldn't you use a... Couldn't you make a substitution in the recipe? A substitution? You mean use a different non-human ingredient? Why? Uh, what if someone's... Vegan? Vegan. Uh, well, I mean- That's a brilliant idea, Alphys! <laughs> Actually, I happen to have an option right here! MTT brand always convenient human soul flavor substitute. A can of which is just over in that corner, or counter. Well, darling, why don't you go get it? I'm gonna check out all the things. It's the oven. Looks like someone forgot to preheat it. Okay, I should probably preheat it. Still fitting with that microwave, eh, darling? Can't blame you for being totally enamored with an electronic box. I feel like everybody's trying to hit on me, and I'm like a child. Ring. Um, is it really a good idea to be getting a snack? Well, I guess I really shouldn't judge you. After all, I'm the one eating potato chips in my PJs. Uh, I mean, <laughs> hey, go over to the right. <laughs> this isn't a show about washing your hands, darling. That's on Wednesdays! You should check out the laser grid. <laughs> As per culinary standard, a death force field surrounds the kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> that is a culinary standard, I suppose. By the way, our show runs on a strict schedule. If you can't get the can in the next one minute, we'll just have to go back to the original plan. So, better start climbing, beautiful! Ring. Oh no! 
There's not enough time to climb up. F fortunately, I might have a plan. When I was upgrading your phone, I added a few features. You see that huge button that says Jetpack? Watch this! Oh, no. oh Jetpack. <laughs> <laughs> there! You should have just enough fuel to reach the top. Now, get up there! Is this like a... This is a dodger. What? You gotta go through the windows. Right there, right there, right there, right oh, there. Oh, I've been trying to avoid this, hitting this uh, wall here. But I didn't actually see them. It's like a rain right there. Let's see what your clowns are. My, my. It seems you've bested me. But only because you had the help of the brilliant Dr. Elphis. Oh, I loathe to think of what you would... Of what would have happened to you without her. Well, toodles! Oh, yes, about the substitution. Haven't you ever seen a cooking show before? I already baked the cake ahead of time, so forget it. Oh. Well, okay. That was a lot shorter <laughs> on the way down. Ring. Wow, we... we did it! We... we really did it! Great job out there, team! Well, uh, anyway, let's keep heading forward. Click. Excellent. An ominous structure looms in the distance. You're filled with determination. Core view. I guess that's the core. Ring. S see that building in the distance? That's the core. The source of all power for the underground. It converts geothermal energy into magical electricity by... Uh, anyway, that's where we're going to go. In the core is an elevator directly to Asgore's castle. And from there, you can go home. Excuse me. Quick. <laughs> yes, I got a little evil there. Unintentionally. You can go home. Go home. R1. Please select a location. So you can go left floor one or right floor two. You're uh, currently on right floor one. Let's go left floor one. Let's go left floor one. Why are you? <laughs> I was just wondering if it changed my options. Um, do, 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 do. And bam, you're back here. Oh hey! Now the guards are gone. So now you can fast travel back. That's pretty cool. Where would I fast travel? Back? I don't really have anything to do back there. If you ever want to go back to Snowden or mm -hmm. or um, Temp Shop or anything. 